Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to some more of The Sims 4. Last we left off, our boys went to bed, and Dean is dreaming about being a spy, presumably very 007, and true to life, Mathis is dreaming about the sweet embrace of death. Too real. We had a, a neighbor in here, but they seem to have left. Uh, I'm not quite sure where she went, but that's fine. I'm not going to complain too much. And Maya is enjoying her new bed, which is adorable. We're going to go ahead and unpause, let life lead, and see where things go. Mathis is getting stanky, and he's going to wake up, and you know what? It's shower time, and I'm with him. It's definitely shower time. The house is looking spick and span. Last episode, we did some cleaning. It was kind of necessary. Things were looking gross. And... The revelation that Dean and Mathis may be growing closer kind of hit us. Dean had spent a couple of days going out with Caleb and, uh, you know, really getting to, to know independence again. You know, did he really want the life that he was living with Mathis? And then on the day where him and Mathis are home, they actually had a wonderful time together. <laughs> they read books on the couch like it was cute. Uh, Mathis went and listened to Dean play the guitar and didn't heckle him or anything um, and seemed to enjoy it. Dare I say, love may be blooming. And Maya is waiting for the mouse. All right, Maya. Oh, my God. She does the little butt wiggle. Oh, my God. Get her. Get her. Yeah, get her, Maya. <laughs> She's like growling at the hole. The butt wiggle. It's so cute. There it is. Get it. My, you're too slow. Oh, hey, girl. How you doing? Oh, you got a pee. You got that pee walk going. Desperately holding it. Uh-oh. 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 Yeah, he's showering, Dean. Oh, no. We just... Dean... Okay. Dean went in there, was mad that Mathis was showering, and then as Mathis was getting out and getting ready to go... He then took his pants off. He waited deliberately for Mathis to get out of the shower before he let his willy hang free. And that's, I feel like that's, that's telling. That's incredibly telling. Troll to forms. See if we can get that, that mischief level up to three. Off to work. Now just Dean is home. He's gonna watch footy ball. Oh, never mind. I lied. He's not watching the footy ball anymore. Not anymore anyway. Empty that. Fill that. Washing the dishes is fine. He's tense. He's not tense anymore. He was tense for a, a, a mere moment and filling the cat food turned his raunchy ass right on. I have to admit, I wasn't expecting that, but maybe Dean's in a little scat play. Listen, far from my thing and not the most healthy, but I don't kink shame. Even like poop kinks. Dean does have work today, so his day can't be too, too busy. But maybe Caleb will come over, or maybe we'll see Caleb walking around. I don't know, he could be sleeping. That's the thing, calling Caleb during the day is a risky venture. Just because Caleb is a vampire, I, I'm pretty damn sure. Uh, and that alone makes things a little bit more complicated or difficult for our buddy boy here. But Dean is having some juice and some cereal, some cheese, never mind, he's having cheese crackers. Mathis has been working relentlessly on an article. 10 minutes before he posted online, a coworker posts the same article. That first of all, I thought I was trying to be internet famous. Second of all, fucking rude. Scoop him back. Coworker has vowed to scoop all of their future works. Now he wonders if this was such a great idea. Great. I'm very excited that I decided to scoop a work and now he's going to vengeance me and trying to scoop my work constantly. So that's exciting. Really happy about that. Dean is listening to spooky music. Huh. Interesting choice of music, Mr. Is Friends of the Vampire, knows Matt has been bit by a vampire, has a fascination with vampires, and in doing so has been reading about scary vampire things. Oh, Dean. The interesting webs we weave. And he's going to just do his weird little dancing. Yeah, man, sure. Is this weird? Dean, is this weird? Viewers? Are you, is this strange? What is this? Yeah, you know what? All right. Would like to come over and hang out. All right. Caleb, here he comes. Let's go outside and wait for him. Uh, We're going out in underwear, but you know what? Dean's feeling flirty, man. Dean's feeling incredibly flirty. 
Yo, did you see Caleb? He saw him walk out in his undies and went, uh-huh. Hey, man, we're right here. Oh. Debate the existence of vampires. Oh. Uh, Two little I pricks on the neck uh, does not mean vampires yeah. exist. Ah. He's probably, in my in my mind, what's happening here is this isn't necessarily debating the existence of vampires. He's, well, I mean, he is, but at the same time, he's also probably debating them to see if really there is more to it than that. Because, you know, Mathis told him about the bite marks. He saw the bite marks. But that doesn't necessarily mean that they exist. It could be bug bites, that kind of thing. So Dean is probably trying to get facts, like debate. Hey, are you sure vampires exist? Here's three reasons why I don't think they do. And then Caleb's like, no, well, here's three reasons that they actually do exist. Or counterpoints to that. He's trying to convince himself that he truly does believe that vampires exist. Tell joke about ducks. Do you, do you do you want to know what I thought that you I mean you probably you probably know Ooh, he's feeling vampiric kiss his hand why did I why do we want him to kiss the hand never kiss the hand that feeds but let's see if he's into it Ooh, I mean there is some romance between the two there's no doubt Dean has a fear about vampires I think he needs to confess it. I think he needs to confess his fear of vampires to a vampire to help overcome it. And talking about it and knowing all the things that come along with it, as well as believing in the in maybe some of the rumors uh, of how you can stop vampires, probably made him a little bit afraid. Is this worth it? Immortality, that kind of thing. I think we're gonna do it. I think we're gonna make. We're gonna, Dean is gonna ask to be turned to a vampire, and we'll see what he says. Because if, if he does. No, he turned him. He turned Dean down. Then, then now the question is: Does Dean continue to try and schmooze Caleb to to do it? He made a go, right? He built up. He debated. He talked about vampires with Caleb. Confessed his fear about them. Debated about them. Really trying to get his head straight about vampires. And then went for it. He had a gut and a gut feeling of like, I'm gonna do this. Ask and immediately got turned down. Now, does that mean that need goes away? No, what it probably does for Dean is actually kind of make him want to explore more, maybe learn more about what it's like to be a vampire before going again, before making that ask one last time. But now Caleb knows we want. Now Caleb knows we want to be a vampire and that knowledge can't be taken back. Who knows what that'll lead to in the future. And Mathis has only been drunk that one time. Even though the old vampire man was like, I'll be back for more, he never came back. It's not a bad thing, it's just interesting to know. Now granted, I also, by the way, I'm recording this before uh, I've read any comments about the naming of the gnome. Hopefully by the next one, or maybe the one after, we'll see. So Mathis got home, he did some superb work today. How's the heat? We're still in the middle of a heat wave. We did not get a, a raise, unfortunately. Let's share vampire knowledge. Caleb's been coming around a lot. He doesn't seem to be around often during the day. And he keeps talking about wanting plasma, so we'll see. I've been doing a lot of research on vampires and I hear there's a way to cure it. How crazy is that? He seems to like it. Maybe the reason he didn't turn Dean is because he doesn't want to be a vampire. Maybe Caleb doesn't want to be a vampire. Dean, we have a problem. With Dean, we have a problem. Can you stop watching your shows? I fixed it last time. Could you fix it this time? Dean? Dean? Dean, get in, Dean, thank you. All right, good luck. I don't think you can kill yourself doing this. It's not like electricity or anything. Dean starts, work starts for Dean in an hour. And Maya is sleeping. Is Mathis trolling the forums? Perfect, he needs to do that. Cause we're gonna get a raise next time we do it. So Dean is, I think, head off to work. So good luck today, Dean. On Mathis's big day, after he trolls to forums, I kind of want him to finish trolling the forums. We might go out. We may, you know, treat ourselves to an excursion into the uh, into the wilds. We'll play with Maya first, though. But first, he needs to get this work done. Maya, after we have to take care of some work first. And there we go, Mistress Level Three, perfect. So hopefully, we will get our raise. Now let's go play with Maya. Mathis can ask due date on Sims who aren't pregnant and dare Sims to streak. He can now kick over trash cans, make prank phone calls, stomp in puddles, and purchase voodoo dolls on the computer. On top of all this, he can also tickle the voodoo doll. Whoa, we can get voodoo dolls. Oh shit, dude, we are truly going into the paranormal hole here. That's awesome. Let's buy one. $950, are we that irresponsible? Are we that irresponsible with money? We can't, I can't, I want to. Fudge, I want to. Let's do it. 
Bind two. What? We can bind it to somebody. Oh God, do we bind it to somebody or we just leave it for now? I don't think we, I, I want like tempted to bind it to Dean. Not going to though. To nearby non-child Sims. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get out of here before I think of things to do to it. Uh, let's leave, 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 leave. Okay, let's go. Let's see what's going on in my Shuno Meadows. Maybe there's something we can do. I still don't understand the whole like clicking on things to go to the convention. I don't know how to make that happen. But Mathis's day out is a uh, thing. We were here before. Oh, it's thundering out. Shout forbidden words. He wants to. Prank call Caleb. Prank call Caleb. Prank call Caleb. Come out. Uh, is your what house you on fire? Then you better Get stop me. spiking it. Uh, get inside. I'm not nearby nearly that stupid to fall for your prank. Get inside, dude. Get inside. Stop standing out there and being an idiot. Get inside. Get inside. Good lord. Can you dry yourself off? Be gross. Oh my god, it's actually me. First of all, please don't tell me I just... I just, like, whiffed my own brand and loved it because, actually, it's too close to my own self. <laughs> <laughs> it is me! I love it. It's me, everybody. There's nobody here, and I can't do anything. I can upgrade their toilets. I'm just bitching right now. We're just going to get some water, I guess. Is there literally nothing I can do in this place? There's nobody here, man. I was hoping there was going to be, like, shops and stuff. I want to just go home and troll to forums, it seems. Stargaze. Ooh, stargaze! Why don't we stargaze while we're here? It's funny, we've really kind of, in a weird way, we've turned into a meaner version of myself. Like, I love the weird unknown shit. I love paranormal. Stargazing is really fun. You can think about aliens and such. Um, but I'm not a troll to forums kind of guy or any of that nonsense. Man has acquired the skill in the logic, which allowed him to play card games, chess, use scientific equipment, blah, blah, blah. But we're just gonna stargaze for a bit. I think that's cool. Let's do it. Dean brought home $240 today. Hopefully he didn't look at our bank account. And notice that we lost 950 of it. Kind of doing our own thing. Whoop. Space print. Ooh, a collectible space print. That's awesome. Wait, wait, wait. What, the, what did we get this from? It's silly for us humans to project shapes we recognize onto the random, ever-changing patterns of the cosmos. That said, the Nis Nebula totally came together to reassemble a T-Rex, right? Not to be confused with T-Rex Nebula, Star of Children's sci-fi cartoons. Wow, how exciting. Uh, where are you going? Are you going home? Run inside. Well, where are you, where are you running inside to, my dude? Where are you running inside to? Nowhere? You gotta go to the bathroom. That's fine. Do what you gotta do. Then we should go home and then kind of decorate a little bit. How late is it? 2 a.m. and I'm still in this park alone. That's kind of depressing if you think about it. We got to stargaze though. What am I doing? No, no, don't nap. Go home. He's in awe of the cosmos. We'll get you home. We might sell one of those paintings. That's worth a lot of money, at least for how poor we are. This is why we, have, we don't live in a mansion yet. We cannot afford it in any way. We'll put it above, yeah, we'll put it right above this. Perfect. The other one is we can just sell. Make some money. And I'm going right to bed to being soaking wet. Dean, what are you doing? Dean, what are you doing? <gasps> Does Dean go out on a date? Is that what Dean wants to do? Does he want to go out on a date? He's already been on a date with Caleb. And Mathis was nice to him, finally. What is happening over here? What happened while I was gone? Dean, what happened while I was gone? Why is this electric getting? What did you do, my dude? Maya, please. <gasps> Maya, what happened? Maya, what the fuck happened? What happened? Hold on, what happened? What happened? What happened? Wake up! Maya, what? Comfort Maya. She smells? We gotta take her to the vet clinic, dude. Mathis, do something, man. Dean, fucking repair this. I cannot believe. 
Hire emergency repairs. Where am I going? Mathis, where are you going, dude? Stop. Comfort Maya, dude. Comfort Maya. Maya's hungry. Don't forget to fill up the pet bowl. It's open. Empty litter storage. Uh, we gotta take Maya to the vet. We can't go out on a date. What? Ha Maya is blue and I'm blaming you, Dean. We need another litter box. This is like permanently stinky, it looks like. Is Maya like a ghost cat? What's happening? What the fuck happened? I don't understand what's going on with Maya, man. She's all messed up. I'm exhausted. I'm gonna sleep. Dean's going to the bathroom. Alright, we're going to the vet clinic. Dean, you did this. I'm tired. She's growling at him! Okay, vet clinic. Perfect. Oh, thank god. Okay. Please. I don't know if cats can die in this game. I don't know if they can die. I don't want her to die, man. Sign Maya in for curing sickness. Yes, do that. Waiting for vet. Get pet examined. Receive treatment. Okay. They'll be with you soon. Examine your sick pet. Please be patient. We really have to wait. The Sims is going to make us wait. We're virtual waiting for a virtual vet for our virtual pet. Hopefully she's okay. She smells. Hopefully this will help. I don't know what else we can do. Play with laser pointer. Don't encourage anyone to mate. Excuse me? Can we get a zoom in on that, Dean? Uh, encourage to mate? No! Don't jo don't mate with any of them. Oh, is she finally getting examined? Just had to wait? Oh, okay. Okay, we just had to wait. I guess I just messed it up by walking around. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, shit. Select a branch for Mathis Gameson. Internet personality or public relations? Internet personality, 100%. We're getting a promotion here. Uh, let's do it. Wait, while we were at the vet, Mathis got promoted. Mathis has been promoted to Simstagram Searcher. He will now make an additional seven per hour and does a bunch of other things. Sweet. We get three days off a week now. Sorry, we have to pay attention to Maya. She's in a bit of trouble and I'm a little nervous. Where are you going? You going to take out the trash? Dean, at the vet clinic? Oh my God, nothing's happening. Dean's not going to work today. Not until we figure out what the fuck is happening. What happened? Why did Dean just leave? He just went to work! He left Maya at the vet! Are you serious right now? He took her home! Alright. Dean is off to work. But we have to stop this episode here. I don't know what to do. I'm a Mathis taker. I'm mad. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, you gotta let me know in the comment section below by hitting that like button and hit, make sure you subscribe for more. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye bye. We like to gamble. We like, we like to gamble. We like to gamble. We like, we like to gamble. We like to gamble. We like, we like to gamble. We like to gamble. We like, we like to gamble. We like to gamble. We like, we like to gamble.